All right. This is kind of um, a second part to the Grand Conundrum because it's an ever going on going huge puzzle. It's not just one little piece that's going to give us an answer. You know, placing them together maybe in our own way because we're all little snowflakes on this planet, you know. Well, I loaded this gun for you. Just so you could see what a loaded gun looks like. <laughs> this is full of the fire of the Lord. And I'll tell you, it takes a while to get like this. It's, this isn't what you would call, you know, there's lots of nasty names they call this stuff. But I consider that taking the Lord's name in vain. So I, I look at it differently because when you recycle and you know get water and food from your own well then you this is not what they use what they call would call urine you know, urine this isn't urine this is different it has been recycled it comes through the wine press and through the temple and it's a uh, um, a lot different so um, in the mornings I mean, I feel bad because you know I can't sit with my eyes open under Need this for five minutes, and I'm sure that I would see a lot clearer, and maybe great things would be happening. But uh, yeah, like I said, it, it is just not pleasant. So I thought, well, really suggesting that is is like pulling out these huge grenades and huge laser weapons that nobody's even ever seen before. <laughs> uh, okay, so we're gonna jump back a little bit gentler and a little slower um, in the mornings I I like to just uh, kind of massage my whole face and anoint my body with the fire of the Lord and uh, a very healing thing. I've had some amazing success with sores and whatnot. Now, the part of the conundrum is if this is full of drugs and things that, you know, it has to become purified slowly. 